we have been for a long time, I think, uh, somewhat inward looking, looking at the cement manufacturing process. Um, what does it mean? What challenges do we have in that process? But I think we also have a role to play in society uh, and in tackling society's challenges. Uh, we have a demographic evolution. If you look at it worldwide, 70% of people by 2050 will be living in large cities. Um, we have uh, a climate change challenge. Uh, we have rising electricity prices for quite a lot of people in households um, and I think we can play a role in addressing these challenges and the role we play is through our product. Um, we basically have concrete, um, concrete for houses, concrete for the bridges of tomorrow, for the hospitals of tomorrow, for the houses of tomorrow um, and that is what we need to bring. How can we bring concrete as a material of choice for sustainable construction of tomorrow. And then we emphasize the most important characteristics of concrete. It's durable, um, it's efficient in terms of energy efficiency, um, of thermal efficiency. It's very safe uh, from a fire safety perspective, for instance. And that is the challenge, is to bring these messages, uh, not only to the public at large, but also to policymakers. And then from there onwards, to take it back up um, the whole production chain and to make sure that policymakers are addressing the industry from a full supply chain perspective. So not only the manufacturing side, but also looking at what the product can contribute to a more sustainable society. And that's where we need to work harder to make that message clear, because that's the only way in which we can also uh, draw the attention to some of the issues that affect the manufacturing side of our business. We all face the same challenges when it comes to climate change, when it comes to energy, but also, for instance, on something like how do you promote the product? How do you promote concrete? And also with policymakers, how do you promote it in terms of sustainability, uh, which is, I think, uh, one of the key words of many policymakers wherever they are in the world, not only in Europe. We will have next year the important um, international conference in Paris on climate change. Um, it would be useful to uh, align ourselves and to talk to our colleagues um, in the African associations to make sure that we are aligned what are their expectations. Because it's true that the whole discussion between developing countries and developed countries is at the core of these discussions. And I think it would be beneficial for both of us uh, to see what the cement industry in these different parts of the world uh, is thinking about climate change uh, and specifically not only mitigation but also adaptation.